Hello and welcome to another interesting video about electric power. I would divide this topic into the discussion of current and voltage. So let's begin. Electric current is the flow of electric charge through a conductor, such as a wire. It is the movement of electrons or other charged particles from one point to another. In physics, there are four fundamental units in the international system that are used to express all other physical quantities. The first one being, the unit of length. The second one is, the unit of mass. The third one is, the unit of time. And lastly, the unit of charge. These four fundamental units, along with their derived units, form the foundation of modern physics and allow scientists to express and measure a wide range of physical phenomena. In terms of physics if we try to define the electric current, it is the amount of charge that passes through an electric conductor or semiconductor in a defined period of time. Or in other words, the rate of change of charge per unit time is electric current. Measurement of current is very important for many reasons. Some of them are Verification of the health of electrical system or measurement of energy consumed in the system, or improving the energy efficiency of the system. But how to measure current? That is where we consider using a current sensor. But what is a current sensor? A current sensor is a device that detects electric current in a wire and generates a signal proportional to that current. So the need can be measurement of AC current in medium voltage or high voltage system, high frequency current like harmonics, or fault current, AC current in low voltage system like electronics, DC current, etc. Here one point to be noted that, apart from the magnitude and type of current some other factors also decide the selection of current sensor, like sensitivity, accuracy, linearity, temperature effect, interference, bandwidth, different situation calls for different technique to be adopted for current measurement like sensing based on Faraday's effect, sensing based on magnetic field effect, sensing based on simple resistive effect. Now let's see what is voltage. Voltage is also known as electric potential difference or electric potential. It represents the difference in electric potential energy per unit charge between two points in an electric circuit or field. In simpler terms, voltage is the driving force that pushes electrons to move through a conductor, creating an electric current. The relationship between voltage, V, current, I, and power, P, is described by Ohm's law. As voltage is proportional to current and the constant of proportionality is resistance. Subsequently in power law they are described as the product of voltage and current. Now let's have a quick look into electric field. Electric field is a region in space where a charged particle experiences a force due to the presence of other charges. The electric field strength at a point is defined as the force experienced by a unit positive charge placed at that point. The relationship between voltage, V, and electric field, E, is given as voltage being equal to the product of electric field and the distance moved by the charge. So work is done when an electric charge moved within an electric field due to application of voltage. In physics, voltage is significant because it plays a crucial role in understanding and explaining various electrical phenomena in simple circuits to complex electromagnetic interactions. It helps explain the behavior of charged particles, the flow of current, and the propagation of electromagnetic waves. Also in engineering, voltage is equally important. Engineers design and analyze circuits, systems, and devices that utilize and manipulate voltage to perform various functions. Voltage regulation, power distribution, signal processing, and communication systems all heavily rely on understanding and controlling voltage. 
Engineers use voltage as one of the key parameters to optimize the performance, efficiency, and safety of electrical and electronic systems. In summary, current and voltage are two important concepts in both physics and engineering, serving as a critical parameter for understanding and designing electrical systems and devices. With this I'm closing this video. We will continue more on this topic discussing further on. The Current Transformer and Voltage Transformer. Hope you enjoyed this video. So please click on like button. Give your valuable comments. And subscribe to this channel. Thank you very much for watching.